Hey YouTube, it's Jennifer. It is Monday, February 11th, 2012. Um, I don't know what week this is. Update? It's a week more than last week, <laughs> so I don't, I don't know. Um, I weighed in, sorry, I didn't take a shower today and whatever. Um, I weighed in today at 215.8. Um, last week I was 215.4. And the week before that, I was like 215.6 or something. So I've been at 215 for three weeks. I'm not considering it a loss or gain. I just consider myself stalled because I really hate those numbers that come after the point. So 215, it's 215. Um, I guess I'm okay with that because I'm actually kind of surprised that I didn't gain a bunch of weight this week. Um, I did not go to the gym all week. Um, mostly because I just didn't feel like it. I was like really depressed most of the week. If you watched the last video I made about the bipolar stuff, which I'm really tired of talking about, but um, I just didn't feel like going to the gym, so I didn't. And the stupid medication, well, I shouldn't say the stupid medication because hopefully it's starting to work soon on some level, but um, I wasn't quite sure that it was the medication at first. Now I'm absolutely certain it is. Um, I was, at first I was just like, okay, I'm just like a freaking pig and I want to eat all this food, but I think it really was just starting the medication because I know other people now who have tried new medications and have had the same kind of reaction. So I don't quite understand how or why that works the way, but anyway, so when I started the new medication, I've been on my Lamictal now for nine days or 10 days. Um, so for over a full week, but when I started it, I was just like ravenously stuffing my face full of crap. Like, um, normally I'm pretty good with making sure I get my protein every day and keeping my calories between 13 and 1500 every day. Um, all week long, I have just been eating cookies and cakes and ice cream and chips and pizza and Taco Bell and just crap I should not be eating. And so my calories have gone, my calories every day this week were close to 2,000, if not a little over, every single day. And I was not getting my protein in um, or my water. And that's very not like me. Like my water, Mia is going to laugh at me, but my water I do pretty good with. I'm not like bad with the water. It's just I don't get as much as I should. Um... But I do pretty good with water, and I always take my vitamins, and I'm always really good with my protein. This is like the first week since I've had surgery where I haven't met my protein goals every day. Um, definitely got my sleep in, though, which I think is kind of a saving grace because you burn fat in your sleep. Um, and you really need to sleep. It also helps control your stress. So without sleep, you have too much stress, and your body will hold on to that weight like crazy. So I think it's kind of a saving grace that I was able to get good sleep this week. Um, so besides that, I really don't have much to update on. Um, blah, blah, blah. 2.15. I mean, that's really all I can cover. I probably have more to talk about after I turn this video off, but this is going to be like the shortest video I've made because I really don't have much to talk about. I'm still looking for jobs. Um, I'm not going to either meet or greet the one in Las Vegas or the one in Atlantic City. Um, I can't even take any kind of trips or vacations like I thought I was going to be able to take. My refund was a lot, but it's not as much as I thought it would be. And apparently it hasn't even been e-filed yet because the IRS is waiting for some kind of tuition. Or my tuition stuff is making the IRS put a hold on it or something. I don't know. Um, so as soon as that gets filed, I'll get my refund back and I'll use most of that for bills, really. I have a list right here, like bills and stuff to my, get, get my car fixed and pay off credit cards. And that's pretty much it. Um, I'm not going to be taking a trip or anything like that. Um, there has been a major positive change in my life, but I think I'm just going to kind of keep that kind of private. Um, <clears throat> it's good. It's positive. Um, what else? I don't know. Just hoping a job comes along soon so I can start saving up some money. I have some plans for the future now. I feel a lot more centered and goal-oriented, and I kind of have some plans for the future now, like far future, like 
nine, ten months from now, and I need money for it. So, um, I don't know. We'll see. Um, I guess that's all. So I'm gonna stop, stop wasting your time now. Um, three weeks at 2.15. I think it's pretty safe to assume that I'm not gonna be in Wonderland by my surge anniversary, which is March 5th. Um, but that's okay. Um, I really have to get this thing out of my head. I keep thinking, once I hit my year, my, my surge anniversary, that I'm gonna stop losing weight. And I think it's just because that whole honeymoon period thing has been so ingrained in my head that I'm, I'm convinced that I'm going to stop losing weight. Like, March 5th, I'm just going to stop losing weight. Um, and that's not obviously true. And I think I, could need, I just need to keep telling myself I can still lose weight and I can still gain weight, just like I can now. It's just a little bit more difficult. It's not going to come off as easily. Um, so I just have to focus on that. And I really do need to get back on track with the food and um, the exercise. And I don't know. It'll it'll work out. I I had kind of have a plan for that too. Anyway, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna stop rambling. Thank you so much for watching. Um, hope you guys are all having a good week, and I will talk to you soon. Bye.